I don't want to let life go by. I want to live life. How do we do that? You see, this is a question that when I look deeply into this question and into this issue, I saw that really, how unfortunate are we that we don't know the basics of who we are? You know, we are going through everything and we don't know what life is. And without life, without knowing what life is, everything that we you know, you think you know, is meaningless. For example, let me say something that, you know, obviously affects everyone. Imam Ali. You know, what does Imam Ali have to do with our life? What does that mean? Everything is good. What does that mean? Everything. You know, what does he have to do with our life? I mean, really, look at Imam Ali, and when you look at our life, we believe in Imam Ali as the Imam. We believe that he's Masum. We believe he's Babul Ilm. He has all the knowledge. Everything, we believe everything like that. But the issue is that what does it have to do? What is the relevance? The only way you will understand the relevance of Imam Ali in your life is to first understand what is life. Then you will know what Imam Ali means to you. Otherwise, you don't even know what Imam Ali means to you yet. What does Imam Hussein mean to you? What does he mean to you right now? He makes me cry, he makes me sad, he makes me grieve. Yes, all of that, true. He inspires me. Oh, great. He brings about love in me. He makes me a better person. Oh, yeah, all that is good. But what is his role in our life? Well, uh, before you answer that, first of all, you need to answer another question. What is life? Then you will know where Imam Hussein fits in there. Okay, Imam Hussein fits in this part of my life because I know what life is. You see, without that, you won't know. So this is what we want to know, life. It's the essential question, what is life? You will learn a formula in algebra, right? Let's say you got the answer, right? You know the answer, you don't know the steps. You just know the answer. So you're giving the answers because you heard it or you learned about it, that this is the answer, but you don't know how to reach there. That's what a lot of people end up doing, us, you know, who listen to majalis and speeches. You know, we get all the answers. We know all the answers, but we don't know how to reach there. We don't know how to connect the dots. And if you don't know how to connect the dots, the answer is useless. Why? Because if anything changes, if any angle, if any perspective changes, in the formula or in the example that's given to you or in the problem that's given to you, you don't know how to reach there. And that's the reason, first of all, you need to know how to connect the darts. And these darts that are being connected is called life. 